Welcome Snack Tackers, my name is Jason and I have another potentially fantastic product to review for you guys today. But first I remind, want to remind you to like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell. Let's get to talking about this new and interesting product. Pringles are not a, uh, uh something that, what, what? Pringles are not something that is not uncommon, is that correct grammar? Not something that is not uncommon, not, not, double negative. Oh no! Pringles are something common on the Snack Attackers. We review all of them and they come out pretty regularly. I'd say every quarter, fiscal quarter, there's at least one new Pringles flavor to talk about. Well, for the first time ever, Pringles is releasing three new Scorchin flavors. Now, these are their traditional flavors, but also spicy in some way. Here's the first one I got, which is Scorchin Barbecue. Scorch and Barbecue Pringles were purchased at Jewel Osco for $1.67. This is, to the best of my knowledge, and this could be proven correct, this could be proven incorrect, the first time that the actual Pringles logo has been changed for the promotion. It shows the Pringles man, who I do not know if he has a full name, Mr. Pringle, uh, with eyes closed and steam coming out of the ears. There are three flavors. Scorchin' Barbecue, Scorchin' Cheddar, and Scorchin' Lime... Chili Lime. Sorry, they're, they're over there. They're gonna be reviewed in another video, but I got them. I don't know if you guys saw the Instagram lately, uh, but I posted a picture of a ton of products I found, and I am gonna slowly get through them day by day. And this is the first one. Now, um, I have high hopes for these, and also not so high hopes. The reason is I love spicy chips, but I don't like barbecue flavored chips. So, let's see what's up. Oh, it just kind of opened. Smells like barbecue chips. I'm going to get a few. These are Pringles after all. They are dusted red, not super visible there. Let's give these a try. Smelled in, you know, oh gosh, well... Who else but Jason? That's a stealing quagmire joke, I can't do that. Well, I mean, I can, just it, it feels morally bankrupt. Ah, <laughs> uh, I mean, I don't, it's, I don't think that's Family Guy's original joke. Whatever, you know what? Let's get to trying these. Three, two, one, snack attack. I don't really know how to describe the flavor that's in my mouth. Barbecue chips, but hot. And it's not a specific hot, I can't place the heat, it's not like it's cayenne or flaming hot. It's just hot. It just like is. Uh, are there any like clues? Well, it would help if I read the part that's in English. I was reading the Spanish part being like, what is Papa Secas? Um, no clues. Paprika for the red. Malic acid, yeah. Uh, mm. No clues. That's interesting. I, I... Hmm. Well, this is, this is difficult. I don't like this particular flavor because it tastes like barbecue chips, but spicy. I don't like barbecue chips. I don't know what it is about them, because I like barbecue sauce on barbecue, which we've discussed, but I don't really like barbecue sauce that much. And I really don't like barbecue chips. I'm gonna give that a snack attack pass, but I can see how this could be liked by someone. If you like barbecue chips and spicy chips, boy have I got a product for you. Out of 10, this one's difficult. I have frequently removed my own biases in the part of the out of 10, and sometimes I've allowed my biases to really take over. Here, I'm going to be far fairer and give it a four out of 10. For me, it's not even average. I think the other two are going to be better. It's really an intriguing thing though, because it's spicy and I, and I like that. Uh, but the question we ask around here is not, Jason, are you going to waffle about all of these individual Pringles flavors? And no, I'm going to potato crisp. <laughs> <laughs> ah! Manic laughter, manic laughter, manic laughter. 
No, the question we ask around here is, would you buy it again? No, I wouldn't buy the barbecue ones. A funny story about the uh, barbecue ones, and I know that I don't usually do a tail end funny story, but the Julasco I purchased these from had barbecue, cheddar, and um, the chili lime. And the very first day I saw them, I, I, I got the flavors. Going back to Jewel the next day, only barbecue was left. So, all the other ones are popular flavors and nobody wants this barbecue. And guess what? You can put me on that list, because I don't want this barbecue. But remember to check the Instagram and Twitter. We're trying our best. We always are. And I'll see you in the next one.